Hey guys, it's Kim Kim. My name is Kim. In case you're curious, thank you for joining me for the video. If you're the welcome, Mia is already ready to interrupt the introduction, so you will be hearing her. She's running around. She's doing her thing. So today, as you can tell by the title, I'm about to tell you all the products that I have yet to use, which means they're products that you have yet to see on my channel. So I'm just making this video to kind of give you guys the heads up of what to expect in the next coming months to a year you know, whenever I get to these products. So if you can't tell, I got a new light. I think it's making things a little bit brighter. I hope it's making things a little brighter. I just have this light on and then like, it's like kind of dreary outside. So I'm playing with my lighting a little bit, y'all. I also got a microphone. So if my voice sounds a little bit crisper or if it sounds a little bit further away, <laughs> we'll figure it out. That's why it's because I have a microphone on. Hopefully it helps eliminate the sounds going on around me because Mia is loud so we're just going to get into all these products that I have not tried yet and um, as I go please let me know products that you've seen or that you have heard about or products that just sound interesting to you so I know to put those towards the top of my list because I'm in the planning stage of content I'm just now getting back I'm posting once a week Mondays at 1 p.m so and then on Instagram and TikTok as well. I'm trying to post more, trying to get my engagement up, trying to, you know, just be booked and busy, guys. Because that took a long time and now I'm finding the perfect headspace to be doing this. So I'm back into my planning and my creating stages. Um, my hair, I gave it a, I gave it a good break from all the constant, co uh, constant content and constant trying of new products. I think we're in a good space now. I'm about to get a trim. After this trim, it's it's full on re reviews okay guys it's full on reviews so i think i've talked long enough i'm about to get into these products i don't know why mia decides right now is when she wants to play and act crazy i really hope y'all can't hear her if you can't ignore me because i'm just trying to excuse her in advance um first product i have is the entwine manipulator and it is a cream gel styler it's to define, elongate, and it gives you a flexible hold. Um, how many ounces is this? It is eight ounces. So it's no hidden fact that I love Entwine products. Like in or out of a sponsorship, I'm using them. I love them. I have not tried this one yet. And this one is really interesting because they have a gel that's like not as moisturizing but it has like a lot of hold so i feel like this will be like perfect in between like of moisture and hold so i really can't get wait to get i can't wait to get into this next i have this bella curls moisturizing and nourishing deep conditioning mask i picked it up because like it's just like really cute um <laughs> i just haven't used it i don't really know why not it just it's just been un like i don't even think i've smelled this product like i try not to open products that i'm not using yet so i don't know what this smells like i know it's got like coconut and honey in it i think yeah coconut and honey that's all i know so hopefully if you guys are interested i can show you guys a wash day video using i actually have another one of these products that i'm gonna get into in a little bit Okay, so next, I'm really not sure how to say this brand. It's like, I guess, Luair. I don't know. This is their Bloom. It's a strengthen, repair, and regrow reparative hair butter. It's 8.4 ounces. And y'all, this is, this almost feels like glass. Like, this is luxury. I may or may not have a code for them. I'm not sure. Oh guys, I did rearrange my description box. So please click my website and my website will take you and show you everything that you need. I have a discount tab. So just go there and you can see what discount codes I have. Thank you. Um, but yeah, I haven't tried this. I, they have an oil that they sent me. This was gifted. Um, they have an oil that they sent me. I have tried that before, but it's an oil. It's hard to give a review on an oil, but I have been doing mini twists a lot more frequently. So I plan to get into this product sometime soon it is one of those very thick butters though so it might have to wait till it gets cold out i don't know 
Next, I have the Kinky Tresses Botanical Curl Defining Gel. It defines, nourishes, and moisturizes, and it is eight fluid ounces. Y'all know how much I love Kinky Tresses. I still use their wash day products. <laughs> and like, it's, it's not embarrassing, because I but I have so many, so it kind of is. I use that Kinky Tresses wash day probably at least twice a week. Not twice a week, twice a month. It's one of those, it's like, that set is the one that kind of sits in my shower. I love it to death. Love it. But yeah, so I need to get into this. I feel like it's another kind of like creamy gel. So hopefully it gives me hold, definition, and moisture. Next is the Camille Rose Black Castor Oil and Chebe Buttercream. It's a strengthening texture butter and it's eight ounces. I have realized I haven't tried a lot of my butters because I'm just now starting to twist my hair more frequently. And when I twist my hair, that's when I like to use butters. So I'll be starting to get into these finally now. <laughs> I'll be able to try these every time I do my mini twists. But yeah, I haven't tried this. I've tried, I think every other product from this line that I wanted to give away a while back. It's just this one that I don't think I've tried. Next, I have Aris Hair Care Coconut Curling Jelly. I don't, I, th I think I may have won this in a giveaway. I'm not 100% sure. I don't think I purchased it. I'm not really, I don't know. Um, <laughs> so yeah, this is another curling jelly. So in between my uh, wash and goes, I'll be doing mini twists. But when I do my wash and goes, I'll probably try to use some product, this product at some point. Next is another gel, which is like y'all's favorite. <laughs> I know I just made that very general statement, but it's y'all's favorite. It's the Camille Rose, the recipe for beauty curl maker with marshmallow and agave leaf extract. And it's 12 ounces. Sorry, it's been sitting. So it's like moving from the side. Anyways, I have the curl maker. I have the curl maker and I need to try it. <laughs> Because the way y'all holler about this product is crazy for me not to have tried it yet. So look out for it. Or let me know if you want to see it. So since I just showed you a Camille Rose gel, I decided I wanted to just show you the other one. I may have another one. I really don't know. But I know I have this one that is the Camille Rose Lavender Crush Defining Gel. This is also 12 ounces. Um, I'm curious to see how this works as well. I'm thinking maybe I could do like a wash and go um battle with like one side have this and the other side have like the curl maker so if that sounds like a good idea you let me know down below or if you want like a full review on each product that's also fine let me know okay next i have the other bella curls product and this is their gotta shake it up it's been sitting for a minute <laughs> but this is bella curls moisturizing and nourishing shampoo it's with coconut and honey and it's 12 fluid ounces to go along with that deep conditioner I showed you earlier, it was just like kind of deep down and things because I had my stash set up in a different kind of way so it wasn't like next to each other. But I am reorganizing my stash as well. So you'll, this is one of those videos to show you. I'm going to reorganize and kind of put all the products that I haven't tried yet on a shelf so I can, you know, go towards those. I'm still trying to figure out how I want to organize it like with all the other shelves, but like I'm going to put all the products I haven't tried together next is another really popular product and it's trey Lux's high definition it's a curl enhancer styling gel um it's eight ounces this is a really popular product in the natural hair streets so i really want to get into it um yeah it's a lot of gels in here y'all because i don't know how long you've been around but my favorite gel is the curl days gel so like when i go to a wash and go and like when I'm not filming, I use like my favorites usually and I hadn't been filming for a while. So I was using that gel up. So that's why I have so many that I haven't tried. But now that I'm filming again, I will try them. Next is a little random kind of, well not random, but it's a little random. Um, it's Way, I think it's pronounced. And this is like their little gift box for your birthday. I believe I've had this for a year. Because I went and got a different box for my birthday this year. So, yeah, I've had this for a year. Um, it is a four-piece set. I'm not going to lie. I have taken out this little perfume in here and sprayed that. Just, you know, because. 
but they have a detox shampoo a and a leave-in conditioner i believe there's also a body cleanser in here but i think i've already used that i left the hair products in here i believe so yeah they have a detox shampoo and a leave-in conditioner which i think is crazy where is my regular conditioner but you know whatever um i guess you'll see those whenever i feel like it i don't know <laughs> Next, I have the Pydana Collection VIYO Curl Reset Maximum Hydration Hair Mask. I did really, really, really like their um, deep conditioner. I believe this is kind of like a pre-poo though, like, like how you use like clays. Like I think you do this before you shampoo. So I have yet to get into this. It's kind of old, so I need to, you know, speed that up, start using this as a pre-poo, you know, so I can finally give you guys a review. <laughs> If you want it i mean just comment below if you just want to see me just use up whatever products i don't know just let me know next i have the myel which i heard it's myel not meel whatever <laughs> i saw like their commercials and stuff and they say myel so i had the myel babasu conditioning shampoo for dry and curly hair types sulfate free and color safe it's eight ounces I haven't used this it's very watery which makes me feel like is it really conditioning because this is how like clarify shampoos like to get down but we'll see um <laughs> at some point i'll probably use that product when i try this next one that i'm about to show you which is the myel sea moss blend anti-shedding gel hair mask which is 12 ounces oh eight ounces um i was looking at the wrong thing so i may have said 12 ounces before and i was really talking about the 12 month mark right here girl my bad um me is sneezing so this is eight ounces and this was like their their gel hair mask so i think it's like a gel to cream type thing i'm very curious about it i'm surprised i haven't used this yet but i will probably do like a myel wash day and like show you that so next is true but not true this is the nature's little secret lemon and rosemary clarifying shampoo um that is eight ounces it, this was just in my last empties y'all so i naturally had to get another one i love this shampoo but i have yet to use it so this is technically an unopened product i have a growth burst serum for organic beauty essence which is two fluid ounces um, this is another product that's not necessarily new to me like I've used it and I have another one that I'm finishing up before I open this one So that's why it's unopened Next I'll probably do these three products just together because it makes the most sense, but um oof, There's a little bit of dust around here y'all. Sorry, but they're all nature's little secret. Um, they are their conditioners so I have nature's little secret rose hydrating conditioner that's eight ounces like this one right here then i have nature's little secrets agave nectar moisturizing treatment that's eight ounces as well and then i have their mixed fruit nutrient rich deep conditioner as well which is also eight ounces i had at one point all four of theirs which had the um milk one as well but i finished that one so I used that one up and now I have all these to go. Um, they're all for, well, this one's for moisture. This rose one is for hydration. And this mixed fruit one is to nourish and hydrate. Now, the only one that I haven't actually tried before is this one, which I believe is like their newest product, I think. So yeah, I have already know I love these. So I just re-upped on them. I know I've used an entire bottle of that Nature's Little Secret shampoo, but I'm really not sure if I made a video. So what I'll probably do is a Nature's Little Secret wash day. Cool. Next is another Myel product. It is the pomegranate and honey curl defining mousse with hold. And it's 7.5 fluid ounces. Um, I actually think I might use this very soon. I haven't decided yet. But as it stands, it is unused. 
Next is another product that's actually like one of my favorites ever. And it's the Leave-In Detangler from Organic Beauty Essence with mar Marshmallow Root and Slippery Elm. It's 10 ounces. I love to use this as a pre-poo. It has the most slip that I think I've ever had in a product. It's a crazy amount of slip. I love it so much. So this is like, I'm on, I was on their PR list for a while. And um, so I have, ha and I've done um, partnerships with them. So I've had multiple of this. So this is just one that I have that's unopened. I don't know if it's just one. If it's another one, I'll just show you. But I think it's just one that I have unopened at this point. Next, I have the Curls and Potions Chebe and Mint Collection Chebe Cleansing Wash. Um, that is also eight ounces. I really need to get into this. I need to start using my clays and stuff for like my Ayurvedic treatments and things. I feel like that's one thing that's really missing for my hair care. Um, so I'm going to start incorporating that into my wash days again. Not every wash day, but I'm going to try and do it at least once a month, hopefully. Next is another set of products, which I'll probably do as a wash day video. And it is the Softy Damage Preventing and Detoxifying Shampoo. Um, this is seven ounces. And then the conditioner to go with it. That's also seven ounces. I love these. They're so cute. I won them in a giveaway not too long ago. Well, actually, it might have been like last December or November. Um, but I still haven't gotten to them. So at one point, I'm going to do a wash day using these products. Next is another product from Nature's Little Secret. I don't, I have a lot of Nature's Little Secret. I won a, um, a $50 gift card with them, I think, some like November, December last year. Um, and I used it when they were having like a half off sale so I could get a ton. So I got those conditioners that I showed you, um, that shampoo, I believe, and I got their Irish styling, Irish moss styling cream, but it's 12 ounces. I've had this before. I know I love it. It's just a lot of products. So I have to be intentional when I use it because I've had it before and I was unable to finish it before. So I had to smell a little funky. So I'm going to make it a point. Like when I open it, like we're going to keep it on a steady rotation so we can get it, get it finished. Okay, I'm, I'm doing a lot of planning now. I need to plan. Okay, next is the Rosiana Naturals Mango Butter and Argon uh, Whipped Daily Hair Moisturizer. It moisturizes and strengthens. It's still taped up. I love everything I put in my hair from Rosiana Naturals, so I don't assume this is going to be any different, and I can't wait to use it. Next, I have some more products from Organic Beauty Essence. I have their deep conditioning masks. There are two different ones. They're, I think it's just two. I feel like I used the third one that I had up. Anyways, um, this is their power up with hibiscus and rice, which I feel like is probably like their strengthening one. So that might be kind of cool to use. And then I have that aloe, aloe vera and olive oil, which is definitely, oh, it's called the hydro boost. So for hydration, obviously, and they are both six ounces. I did use up one of those before, so. But it was, I think, it was like their mango butter one. Love that one so much. Um, this is Pydana Collection's BIYO Curl Enhancer for Maximum Hydration Hair Cream. That is eight ounces. Um, I have no excuse for not using this. I, I need to just do it. I need to use it. I need to record it. I need to, you know. I also am thinking like from these products, I may also develop a giveaway. Instead, I'm trying to decide right now. So we don't know. Not all these products, don't get excited. Don't get excited now. But I'm thinking maybe some of these might end up being in a giveaway. I don't know yet. Next is the Chebe Pripu from Negus Banda. Love this stuff. Obviously, this is a repurchase. It's been in my empties before. I don't know if it I don't remember what empties this was in but it's been in empties so i'm excited to get back into this next is the curl mix wash and go growth serum from their masters collection and it's two fluid ounces um i did create some content for them on some sponsored content actually some content for them on instagram and from the content that i created i didn't really need to use this so i still have this unused
you might just see that in a video if I like if I'm if I just finished mini twist or something and started oiling my scalp um yeah next I have the tray I think it's tray life tress life I don't know I have their apple cider reboot tea rinse um and it's 16 ounces I'm not really sure this can be okay so it can be used as a shampoo or as a pre-shampoo type thing so yeah and I also bought this um because this was made in North Carolina and they have like a store um and either Durham or Raleigh I can't remember which mall it was in I think it's South Point which is Durham so like I went into the store and I saw these products and I said, oh my gosh but uh, at that time, I didn't live in Maryland. I mean, I lived in Maryland still, and I was flying. So I couldn't fly with, you know, the full-size product. So I ordered it online. But yeah, so. Next is another Camille Rose product. And it's Janssen's Moisture Max Conditioner with Coconut Milk and Aloe Vera. And it's 8 ounces. I have so many conditioners that I need to try. Next, this is a little embarrassing. It's kind of old, okay? This is the Mish Peppermint Candy Cane Limited Edition Holiday Deep Conditioner. It is eight ounces. I have no excuse. I have no excuse. I need to put the, like when I'm um, organizing my shelf, I need to put the products that are older that I haven't used towards the front and push the other ones, that, the newer ones towards the back. That's what I need to do because this, there's no, there's no excuse. Next are two more um, Trey Lux products. This is the Curl Renew and Restore Gentle Cleansing Rinse. Um, it is eight ounces. This product I feel like I want to try after I use like a cleansing mask or something like that. And I just need to make sure I get all that out. Because I've heard this is very gentle and like moisturizing, like almost like a co-wash. So we'll see. Um, and then I have their famous Untie the Knot Nourishing Leave-In Conditioner, which is eight ounces. Um, I'm going to try and see, like, if this can be paired well with other, with, like, gels. Um, if it does better with gels or if it does better with creams. So I can figure out how to incorporate this because I smelled it and it smells amazing. Next is the main choice. I think this may be... This is one of the only main choice products I have in my stash. Um, it's the Alpha Easy on the Curls Detangling Hydration Conditioner, um, and it's eight ounces. I'm not really sure how I ended up with this, to be honest. I think I want a giveaway. <laughs> I think I want another giveaway. It sounds like I want a lot, but like based on the ones that I actually apply for, I don't be getting them. All right, I have um, a Camille Rose Lavender Quench Deep Conditioner. That's eight ounces. Um, there's a lot of Camille Rose products in here I haven't tried yet. I need to get on that. I might just do like a Camille Rose start to finish type thing. That's what it looks like. I need to do a start to finish for a couple of different brands. <laughs> and then I have the She Scented Moroccan Gold Deep Detox Clay Mask. Um, obviously, it's to detoxify and condition. And it's eight ounce, eight point five fluid ounces. So it was eight. I don't know if I mentioned that, but um, yeah. So we're almost done. Last, I have this Uhai Uhai. I'm not sure how it's pronounced, but it's their conditioner. It restores moisture, and it's thirteen ounces. The reason I haven't tried this one, but I've tried their other products, is because they gave me a. I'm sorry, they gave me a deep conditioner and this conditioner. So. If you know me, you know I'm going straight for the deep conditioner. And it was good. So, like, I'll get to this when I get to it. If I get to it. But that concludes this video, y'all. I've been yapping. Like I said, there's a lot of products here. So I need to get to it. There are also, this is embarrassing, there are some other products that I haven't used yet. But those kind of came in this quarter. So I have to do, like, a... A video to show you like a, a um a haul kind of thing before I just kind of put them on the shelf so yeah that's why 
there's still more products that you haven't seen yet. But that's all I have for you guys. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Tell a cousin. So tell a cousin. Follow me on Instagram and TikTok. The links are in the description box. And please, if you are curious, I think I have I have a discount code for Organic Beauty. So you can go to my website, go to the discount tab, and get you some products. Um, there's also other discounts there as well as my active ones. I went through and, and tried them out to make sure that they work still. So all the ones that still work are up there. Um, but that's all I have. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.